Good morning, everyone, from Nanping, a cluster of little villages deep in the mountains of Zhejiang in Tiantai County. Last night, I stayed in a village here in Nanping, in a guest house run by one of the locals in an old home from the early 1900s. I started off the morning with a simple breakfast of rice porridge with taro and then got on the road. Today, I have a long road ahead of me. I'm biking all the way from here to the city of Lianhai. So I really hope you guys will be joining me. There's gonna be a lot of scenery and a lot of excitement coming up on this route. So don't miss out, let's go. It's a cold, misty morning, but the streets are bustling nevertheless. Everyone is out doing their morning things. Unlike in the city where everyone is rushing around in cars or scooters or catching the metro, lots of people here are just walking, just ambling along. The pace of life is much slower here. These fall colors just look straight up fake against the dull, misty background, but I swear guys, they're real. This is definitely one of the most peaceful, quiet places I've ever biked in. It's so quiet. And it's like misty right now, which makes it feel even more quiet, which doesn't make sense because sunlight doesn't make noise but it just feels quieter because of the mist. It's like kind of spooky, kind of eerie, but I like it. I love it, it's great. Can't tell if it's raining or if the mist here is just really like beefy. <laughs> like this, there's literally water droplets hitting my face. Look at these leaves. Look at them. So beautiful. Sorry in advance if some of this footage turns out a little bit blurry because it is raining right now. My fingers are numb. I'm being rained on. But we're just gonna keep going because there's literally nowhere to stop anyway. This guy gets it. Look at him go. Forging along through the rain. Oh my goodness, a street market? We can't miss out on that. Taking a left turn. This village wasn't a part of my itinerary before, but it is now. It's <laughs> This是安全在吗? If not for the fact that alcohol makes me nauseous like 90% of the time, I would try some of this. Maybe next time, when Wei is with me to finish the leftovers. I have located the healthy snack stand. Time to make a contribution to the local economy. Still being rained on. Passing through a small town, looking for a place for lunch. Haven't found a restaurant yet, but I have found an endless supply of tangerines. All the tangerines you could ever want or need, right here.
finally found a place to have lunch, just having a simple classic item, noodles. These are the kind of hills where biking and walking are equally slow, so I'm just not gonna stress my knees out. And we're just gonna walk this bad boy. Like pulling my bike along here like a like a pack mule. So we're actually not very far away. Ah! Too heavy on the back. We're actually not very far away from the city of Lehigh by kilometers. It's like 20 kilometers away. But if it's gonna be uphill like this, well, we'll be on here all day. Look at this. I mean, I kind of knew it was coming. Like when you look at these squigglies, like you know it's gonna be a mountainous road, but like, come on. Scenery is pretty nice up here. Got some trees and foggy mountains on the right and lots and lots of tangerine groves on the left. Look guys, a shortcut. Never mind. I don't think it's actually worth the effort. Look how much progress we've made. Look at all those roads squiggling below. Oh my goodness, like half of the footage from this entire ride is just gonna be like blurred out from raindrops. Every time I wipe the lens clean, it gets rained on like two seconds later. So this is just how it is today. Check this out, eco-friendly anti-theft fence, the death pricker fence. But look at this, someone has actually made a nest in this death trap. I guess it does protect well from predators. Getting rained on, but there seriously is nowhere to stop. So we're just gonna keep going and going and going right through the rain. Finally, we have emerged from the idyllic mountain villages and we are back to urban life after three whole days of exploring the beautiful countryside. And as with many cities in China, the countryside continues up until the very last minute. Welcome to Linhai, everyone. Beautiful fall colors, even in December. The next day, I biked from Lianhai to Taizhou, but there wasn't quite enough footage to make a video. But here are some of the things that I saw along the way. Thanks everyone for joining me on the Zhejiang bike tour. Throughout these four days, I never actually left the Taizhou region, and Zhejiang province has 10 other regions waiting to be explored. So I will definitely be back in the future. Hope you guys enjoyed the beautiful countryside scenery and the interesting encounters, and I will see you next time. <laughs>